Well, reports coming on different social media platforms have indicated that President Museveni is not happy with some UPDF top commanders over persistent ADF attacks in the Rensori sub-region where the latest attack claimed the lives of two foreign tourists and a Ugandan tour guide. Other reports have suggested that President Museveni is pondering on sacking CDF Chief of Defense Forces Lieutenant General Wilson Badi. Yes, some online media channels have reported that President Museveni is not happy about what is happening in Kasese district and he's thinking about sacking CDF General Wilson Badi. Well, President Museveni yesterday, while commenting on the unfortunate incident that happened in Queen Elizabeth National Park, he said the terrorists will be defeated like he defeated Joseph Kony in northern Uganda and the cattle rustlers in the Karamoja sub-region. Uh, Museveni also revealed that the murdered foreigners were a couple and they had come in Uganda for their honeymoon. He also promised that Uganda's High Commission in the UK will reach out to their families and provide necessary support in this tragic situation. Well, that is the latest update coming in from President Museveni's camp. In case you have anything on your mind about this story, the comment section is very open for you. Away from that to the entertainment industry, uh, the biggest story making headlines in the entertainment industry today is the return of UB40 in Uganda. Yes, UB40 will be in Kampala this December on the 21st after 15 years. Their first time in Uganda was in 2008 and they return in December 2023 at Kololo Independence Grounds. Well, this information was revealed by Next Media Services last evening and we can't wait to have another fantastic experience with the UB40. Well, that is the latest updates I have for you right now on the Buzz UG. Subscribe and also tap on the bell for all the notifications. Don't forget to follow me the other side of TikTok, Amela Zmilo, aka Fuller. It is a bye for now. Thank you.